What's up guys, I'm Luke and you are watching The Creative Way. So today we are going to do uh, a plugin showcase. I will be starting a series of this. I'll post about once a month for this. Um, and we are going to do a cool hub plugin today called Deluxe Hub. So you'll want to search it up and then download the latest version and then restart your server. And I'll see you guys after that's done. All right, so we are back and I have just joined my server. Should be working, here we go. Yes, so. And now this automatically, yes, as you can see, if I do a double tap, just like that. So there's a server selector, basically, um, you can edit these in the config file. There's server information, uh, website, store, Discord. I can give myself a uh, fly. Oops. GMC. Um, yeah, so let me walk you through the different plugins and things it has. So if we do Deluxe Hub, just like that. We get tons of things that we can do. Oh, if we click the tab menu, as you can see, it has that, uh, the website, the store, you know. Um, this is a really great plugin. So you can do slash vanish. You can do slash unvanish. Or slash vanish still. Um, you can actually add holograms with this plugin, but I already have holograms, so I don't need it. Um, Deluxe Hub Info gives you the disabled worlds, the custom menus, slash clear inventory, boom. Oh yeah, so it is a thing. Hold on, let me get back in so I can show you guys this. Um, so you can set all of this up in the config. This is players, so you can actually hide players on your server. Um, so if I were to show this, then I can now see players. And these are announcements. I think they're great. Um, you can customize those in the config. We'll be going over there in a second. Um, so those are some great things. So if we do Deluxe Hub, boom. Um, we can set lobby to right here. Slash set lobby, boom, boom. And if we do slash lobby, it takes us there, GMC. Um, one other thing that I really just found out a little while ago. Let me go like that. Then it will launch us like that. Um, I think that's great. Yeah. Uh, sorry, that's a lot of fun. So, as you can see on the right of my screen, I have a scoreboard. It says Deluxe Hub 3 with the player and the rank. Um, you can configure that in your config as well. So we'll be heading over there very soon. Let's just finish looking at all the things that they have. You can do slash fly, you can do slash lobby. Uh, one of the th great things, they have Deluxe Hub Clear Chat, which you can easily clear the chat and you can lock the chat just like that. So I could say, since I'm the owner, I could say, hi, uh, I locked chat for a min. But then I could unlock it. And now it's unlocked, so other people could also do that as well. So... I think that's really all we're going to look at for the in-game. This is more of a config-based plugin, so we'll just head on over to the config. This video is sponsored by Sangata. Sangata is the one-stop shop intended to make finding the ideal plugins for your Minecraft server simply. They uphold reasonable and just business practices by acknowledging client and creator feedback and are continually improving their platform. Make sure you guys check them out with the links below to find unique plugins for your Minecraft server. So you'll go on over to the plugins and you'll see your deluxe hub folder. And then you'll do config.yml. And if you want to do 
um, some disabled worlds, like if I want to do um, kit PVP. I can list different worlds that I want to be disabled with this. So if I just want my hub world to be enabled, then I could do that. Um, Anti-world downloader, obviously, yes. If someone is trying to download a world, it will notify an admin. Um, the scoreboard is enabled. Server, uh, yeah, so uh, refresh, yes. Um, we can change all of this. I'm not really going to be changing anything in this. I'm just going to show you. Um, so if you guys don't have placeholder API installed, I'll show you guys that in a different video. Um, but basically what it is, is it is um, something great that you can actually have placeholders like at player. And that can be their player name. And then vault rank, that could be the rank that they have on the server. The tab list is great. Um, the announcements I think are awesome. You can also configure these here. Launchpad, as I was saying, redstone block, stone pressure plate. Uh, the double jump. I'm going to do the cooldown to be one point. No, we'll just do one. Mm, point five seconds. Um, command block. No, 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 no. I actually like command blocks, so I'm going to make that false. Uh, Anti-swear. You. This is where it gets interesting. You can do the player. You can do the items. You can do the blocks. Uh, the messages. I'm actually going to do this because I want to do this. Uh, yeah, so we'll just... Control X. Um, we'll do... Welcome to Creative Craft comma player exclamation point and then we can do player left us uh no no has left the game we'll get him next time or something creative like that um welcome comma blah 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 to the server um powered by creative craft so you can change so many different things in here the player hider feature, the server uh, selector, the um, the info book that you saw, the startup items that you saw with me in the beginning, uh, we can all configure in menus. So after you go into menus, you can do server selector .yml, and you can add in. I was showing you this earlier. I think you can go server selector and. You can see factions, survival, and you can add in your own custom. So we'll add in, I don't know, we'll do survival. And then uh, it says do this. So MVTP comma player world. So I have a multiverse server, but if you have a bungee, you can do a bungee. Um, MVTP player survival. Uh, actually, no, I think, I think it's just MVTP survival. All right, so now that we've edited some of this stuff, let's go back and we'll restart our server and see how our changes affected the outcome, uh, sorry, affected the plugin and how much better our server will be. All right, so I, our server has restarted and let's join and see what's different. See, it says powered by Creative Craft now. And if we do this, oh, maybe not. Maybe we did have to keep that player thing in there. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's basically it for Deluxe Hub. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.